In today's video, we're looking at four of the best Prime Day deals on solar panels, both rigid and flexible options that I've personally tested Welcome to the Off Grid Solar Power Channel. I'm Amelia, and here we share practical everyday ways to get the most out of portable solar panels and power stations. If you enjoy rural tests and tips like this, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and tap the notification bell so you don't miss future videos. And if you find this video helpful, um, throw me a quick thumbs up or comment below. It really supports the channel, so thank you. Also, quick note before we start this video, it isn't sponsored. I've used all of these panels myself and really like them. If you check out any of the links below, it's a small way to support the channel, and I truly appreciate it. Before we jump into the deals, I just want to say this. I really believe everyone should own at least one solar panel. There's something empowering about making your own energy from the sun. It gives you a peace of mind in an outage, freedom when you're off grid, and just this feeling of independence that's hard to beat. Even one panel can make a big difference. All right, let's dive into the deals. The Zooka via 450 watt portable solar suitcase has been one of the strongest performers, even in cloudy weather. It fully charged my All Powers R1500 in about four hours. Their smaller 200 watt portable suitcase also impressed me with a peak of 171 watts in testing. I'll link both panels below along with their official website since it sometimes has the best pricing. So make sure you check both out. Energy's 400 watt solar blanket is one of my personal favorites. On a partly cloudy day, it charged my R1500 portable power station in four hours, peaking at 363 watts and holding steady above 149 watts, even under heavy cloud cover. Their 400 watt portable solar suitcase, on the other hand, also performed really well, hitting a max of 415 watts in my tests. I'll update the description with current pricing and discount codes as soon as they're confirmed. And now calls on. I tested two of their 100 watt rigid panels in series. They charged my Anchor C800 Plus in about three and a half hours, reaching a peak of 228 watts. Their 100 watt flexible panels also stood out, giving me a max of 103 watts each, which is excellent for flexible panels. Check the description for updated prices and um, coupon codes as well. Sometimes the best Prime Day deals and discounts aren't on Amazon. They're directly on the brand's website. That's the case with Bouge RV, who are running special sales on their panels. We personally own three of their 200 watt rigid panels, and they're the best performing panels we've tested. Their 100 watt panel is also a reliable option. I'll share updated prices and codes in the description once confirmed. And those are my top four solar panel deals for Prime Day. Prices on solar gear have been moving around a lot lately. So if you've been thinking about adding a power station or a quality panel to your setup, now's a great time to check these out. Like I said earlier, owning even one solar panel gives you that peace of mind, a sense of independence, and the freedom to know you can always make your own power when you need it. The channel is all about finding the best solar gear, testing it in real world conditions and helping you get the most value out of it. If that sounds helpful, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any upcoming reviews and testing videos. For more detailed reviews of the panels I mentioned today, check out the playlist linked right here. And that's it for this video, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.